Executive Sales Director at the Bahamas Tourist Office in Plantation, Florida, Carrie Fountain, says that social media is here to stay. And if we are not proactive in our approach, we are essentially allowing the online community to define our tourism product. I think what, you, what Minister will challenge us today to do is, okay, we know social media is here. What are you going to do about it? And he is taking the necessary steps where within the Ministry of Tourism, we would actually have a social media department. What it's going to look like, I think we're still trying to figure it out. Um, but we know it's here to stay, and we have to structure our organization accordingly. Fountain says that there are two streams of social media that we can start taking advantage of immediately. One is customer service related, the other is the advertising realm. There's social media where you're monitoring the trip advisors um, and the different travel blogs and understanding what it is the customer is saying about your hotel. If they're complaining, then you fix it. If they're complimenting you, then those are the things that you need to do more. Uh, and then social media on the advertising front, are they speaking positively about it? Green light. Are they neutral about it? Yellow light. Are they talking negative about it? I'm a red light. And those that are talking positive about an event, you know they're interested. And, you know, through companies like an Indusa, what you can now do is have access um, the name of the customer, uh, their email address, and you can even segment it into household income so you know you're going after the right profile customer. So, to me, uh, you know, what we're talking about a lot is social media, how to get to the out islands, how to make it bookable and accessible. The executive sales director says that for the smaller boutique hotels and tourism related services, having an online presence is a must. Fountain is stressing that players in our tourism industry must get more involved in the marketing of their businesses. I think, you know, just reaching out to past visitors that may not have had a positive experience and just saying, hey, look, I'm listening to what you're saying, I'm reading what you're saying, and I want to correct the problem. Now, we need to do that before they leave, but at least if we start to do it, um, even if they get back to, you know, home, um, I, I think we need to start. And then the next thing is um, social media in terms of monitoring what people are saying um, uh, and, and, and then whatever it is that they're talking about and they like and you have an event coming up, then you need to get that information in front of them and not only get the information in front of them, but also say, okay, look, we have Marathon Bahamas coming, we have this, whatever it is, Junkanoo Summer Festival coming, and oh, by the way, um, if you visit Bahamas.com, you're able to take advantage of this special offer for a limited time to get there. And so those are the things um, that you're going to see us doing in our office. Um, and, but in our office in Plantation, it's going to be more speaking to the vertical markets especially, uh, speaking to fly fishermen, speaking to boaters, uh, speaking to divers, uh, speaking to people who get in their own plane and fly over the 52 miles to Bimini. For the Tourism Today Network, I'm Gina Seeley.